But I realized all of my streaming stuff was just a bit set up wrong for a second then. Let's hope that's still all working. Because <laughs> it's not a Moogie stream without technical difficulties. Okay, hi. Was it all was it all broken? I'm imagining it was all broken. I break everything. Morning. I couldn't sleep, so I decided I would get on Andy because I miss her. And then I was like, ah, do you know what? Let's stream and see what happens, eh? Let's stream and see what happens. We probably won't be around for long. But I just wanted a reason to be Andromeda Gotti. Wait, no, Quill. Fuck it. Who am I? <laughs> And we also need to make our way back to Emerald Ranch. Oh, hello. So, thinking, I'm thinking. I uh, got an Andy, realized we don't have any guns from when we had them taken off of us in that shootout. And we also only have 150 to our name. So I did pick up a job board job because I thought if anyone's going to give job boards a go, it will probably be Andy. And we took up a ranch job at Emerald. And then we got a telegram from Zip saying go to Blackwater so we went back to Blackwater and we haven't heard from him since so now we're just going to go back to Emerald and finish our ranch in finish our ranch in which by the way I were already attacked by the bloody bull fucking thing <laughs> I don't think ranching is for Andy but I want to finish the job because it was like a hundred dollars and then we can use that to buy ourselves something better than a cattleman. It'll be a nice chill and easy morning, I think. I 
Yeah, she sent that. Does the... Oh, no. I don't think... Does the job go away if you go too far from it? No. we still got to do more chickens. <laughs> Just call me Handromer to the farmer. Will it be, though? I hope so. <laughs> I think so. Nice, chill and easy. We're just getting into our, our groove. It's been a while since I've played No Brains Andy. Uh, do I want to go this way? Yeah, I want to go this way. We woke up. So I wasn't going to stream. And then obviously I checked telegrams and was like, oh, actually, maybe I will. But woke up and the only two telegrams we have had since poor little Andy's brain problem, the most recent one, <laughs> was from Zip saying, I get out on the 29th. I'm sorry. I love you. I'm in Sissica. And then there was another one from Jenna Pearl, the Sissica bitch, like as in Zip Sissica bitch, who was like, I, I don't understand what it said, but I read it as Zip's been cheating on Andy with her. So I was like, have you been cheating on her with me? And then we got a telegram back saying, no, I haven't. I'm going to Blackwater, meet you there sort of thing. And then I went to Blackwater and I have not seen them. So I'm going to go back to doing what we were doing and they can come find me if they want. Because I've tried Robin with just a bow and arrow, and I'm telling you right now, people don't respect the bow and arrow like they should. I'm not entirely sure. They should low. I'd rather be shot with a bullet than an arrow. Right? Right? Me too. I'd rather be shot with a bullet than an arrow. Like, I feel like arrows are the same as like when you get a fish hooks, like hook stuck in your hand by accident, which I know is not something everyone has happening. I'll pretend I'm not shitting myself. Why are you shitting yourself? I don't want to know. Depends on the arrow or the bullet, yeah. Well, like, I imagine it's like getting a fish hick, like when they have the double barb. Because obviously with an arrow, because it's got the little, like, the triangle, I don't know. I'd, I'd, I think I'd rather be shot with a bullet than an arrow. Do you know what, actually? I'd rather not be shot at all. That's chef's kiss perfection. So we're, 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 we're literally guys. We're literally gonna go and do some some ranching and you can keep me company. If it's got the triangle bullet, yeah. Oh yeah, maybe. Okay. So I need to find out where there you go, so I've got to go do chickens. Can I hitch this horse somewhere that's not him being an arsehole? Yes. Do you know what we need for this? Not that dear. But also. Okay, is the bull gone? Because that asshole kept trying to kill me earlier. He's gone. Okay. Then I guess it's time to shovel some shit. Shovel. Oh, I got a pitch book. What do I go shovel now? Don't, don't you, don't, don't you get angry at me. Where am I meant to go and shovel? Just anywhere? Oh no, over there. Leave me alone. I'm just trying to clean up after you. Now what do I do with it? Sir, could you please tell me what to do with me shit? Because I don't know. <laughs> okay, over there. 
disgusting. Wait, where's the next bit of shadow? Oh, leave me alone! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! I put the shit in there though. Why is it not? No, I'm trying to. I'm trying to put the shit where it meant to go. Okay. Right, we've got this, Andy. Listen, we've changed three sets of diapers or nappies, whatever you want to call them. For the la no, go in the barrel! I don't know how... It no! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Oh no, where did my shovel go? No, do I have to do it again? No, <laughs> we did not change the diapers with a pitchfork. No, don't make me do that again. If I run, I drop it. No, because I didn't want them to kill. Look, he's coming after. I'm going to kill him. I'm just going to murder the cows. No, you go over there. That's what I thought, you assholes. No. Oh, I thought I heard something coming after me then. Oh, who's this? Is that... Is that my husband looking like Santa Claus? Oh, hello! Is this your horse? Yeah, it's my horse. Is that my... God damn it. ...beautiful husband? What? what? I'm gonna beat the. I'm gonna <laughs> fucking. No, not I'm my head. Kill the fucking cattle. Oh no, please do! I've been trying to dodge them for ages. We thought you got fucking kidnapped. Why? Because we're at war. But why? We're picking up shit. Yeah, I need money. Why? Why would you tell me you're heading to Blackwater then? I went to Blackwater and I waited there for ages and you didn't show up, so I came back to finish my work. I drank two coffees. Two whole coffees whilst I were in Blackwater and watched a bunch of law ride through. That was how long I were in Blackwater. Andy. What? I, I need to go. There's an ambush happening on Emerald real quick. On Emerald? He goes, yes. We're at Emerald. I know. Get on my horse. Get on. Okay. I fucking oh, knew that was I love you. <laughs> I love you so much. Andy, you're making things so much worse. <laughs> I feel like I am, Anna. Why are we ambushing Emerald? There's nobody here but me. Because we thought you got fucking kidnapped. Oh, why though? We're at war with the bastards. Right. Okay, I'm gonna go take myself to Manteca Falls and throw myself off. No, no, no. Get the fuck back on my horse. I'm saving time. It's called efficiency. Those, all those are dead. It's the new bastards. They'll just put a knife in your leg and twist it around a bit. Oh, right. My leg's pretty much been numb since, like, the last head injury, so that's fine. As long as I go for the, the numb leg, I'll be good. She's fucking fine. Oh. Hello. Where's Isaac? Thank God. Sending you a telegram, I think. Is he that blind? <laughs> he might have uh, another telegram from Dr. Did you not see us? No. What? How did you not see us? I gotta, I gotta go. Like, I don't okay. know. Did you wander off all the time? If I'm not shoveling shit no more, can we please go to that little place down road where I left me other no. clothes? I'm going no, where... to find Domino. He's at Wallace Station. He said he has something of mine. I have to go and get it. All right, let's go to Wallace. Can I please do this not looking like I'm covered in shit? Nope. This is your fucking... This is what you get for not telegramming me back. I told you to wait What do you mean not telegram? I never got that telegram. 
Go check your tele. Not I'm right gonna now, go. But... Okay. Yeah. I never got that telegram zipper. Zipper fillion quillis. One, two, three. I might need to get my horse some water real quick. Please tell me you're not a. Oh, my God. oh my God. Protect me, Ed. Protect me, Ed. What? You almost landed on me. No, I, I jump off that bridge all the time. I'm pretty sure I buried someone that thought he was my dad. Right here, actually. <laughs> I see why you're shitting yourself now. And he just living our best life shoveling around. shit. <laughs> oh man, I just wanted to do some ranching. I just want to try it out, guys. I no haven't done way it you're yet. Going in there alone. No, I mean, I mean, I go in alone first. He's expecting me to be there alone. Yeah, we swing the trail. Did he tell you to come alone? No. I he don't know what's happening. Along, but if I come in there alone, then he maybe right, well, come out where he's hiding. Ride a little bit in front of us, and then when we get closer to Wallace, we're gonna go to a very slow trot. Okay. Oh, anyway, I got a telegram from your prison lover. What? Right? Yeah. Wait, what? Jenna, she said you've been sleeping with her or something. I actually didn't understand what she said. She spells worse than me, and I can't read at best of times, but. I'm pretty sure the telegram said that you've been with Jenna in the biblical sense. What does that even mean? We're, we're supposed to lose Isaac. Wait, what do you mean? I'm so confused. Why are we out we're, we're giving him a little bit of a lead. That's a perfect lead. I No, I'm not with Jenna. In, in I know you're not with satanic. Jenna. You're married to me. Right. I haven't been fucking her either. It's fine. I'm gonna murder her. Yeah, please do. No, I really am. I'm gonna go Siska right now. I'm just gonna knock on the doors and be like, hello, let me in. I've come back home. That works. It does, don't it? I'm gonna feed her to, like, some of the alligators that swim around there. Blueberry Junior. I don't know what that are. It's an albino alligator. Oh, yeah, I'll feed it to that. No, I've never okay. seen the, the alligator. I'm really upset as well. I love Sissica. That's Where else in the world do you get to have a pet reptile like that? The first time I was in Sissica, and Zip and Isaac were just getting dropped off too, uh, Cass and I got chased by panthers in the potato crops. And then as we were trying to get to the actual, like, jail area, we got chased by, like, four gators. Jesus, You're fucking mittens huge. and blueberries? Uh-huh. I like blueberries babies. Why do they call them blueberries when they're not blue, though? I still don't understand that one. It's just the name. I was told blueberries mama's name was Bojangles. Yeah. yeah. Blueberry Bojangles. I think he went left at that ranch, Cheddar. I don't think he came up this way. Speaking of ranching, I've got shit to shovel. No, I feel like we're going to beat him. Yeah, I know. They've been itching to get a hold of them for days. So I should fill you in. I left the Quill Gang. No, I know you did. I were really supportive uh, of that. Okay, and then Jack started a war. Jack Kettle Balls, remember him? Oh, the weird, creepy old man. That's right. He started a war, and then. We picked up Waggy, and Waggy started like eight wars. Waggy, Waggy, Waggy. That was the one that were dating your sister, weren't it? Right. And then Hannah dumped him to go fuck a lawman, an ex lawman. Oh, right. Is she still alive? Hannah? Yes. Oh, that's a shame. 
Probably. I think. Thank you for the follow, Elban and Belshan. I'm gonna I'm sorry I butchered it. We're changing that. Here Hi, we go. Andy. Hello. I don't know who that are. This is Cass's cousin. I have to at this point. I don't know who that are. Cass, remember the I don't know, but you remember the fellow that introduced himself as Jacass and then Oh, you're you talking him about Jacass No, I called him Jashit or something like that. <laughs> I can't remember right. what it were, but it was very intentionally meant to be insulting because I thought you were a bellend. Why? Yeah, you said who's that, so that's who Cass is. Oh, oh my and condolences, then... lady. No, no, no. They're not actual They're not cousins. Actually, I just give her shit. Have you ever noticed how he has no teeth? He's a bit gummy. Yes? Yeah, he's like an old man. Ask him to smile. He's just all gum. Huh. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter anyways. I ain't riding with him no more. Still good with him, but I stepped away from the phrase. I don't know what they are either. His gang, the Frey gang. Cass Frey. Did you just say ass Frey? No, Cass Frey. Oh, okay. Because, you know, the first thing I thought you said sounds really painful. Changing. Fuck yes. Ah. Oh, sorry. There you are, Isaac. Right. We'll just put that on. Too much of a loop. We'll dress like Sawyer. Oh, we're gonna dress like Sawyer. Cause we think we're funny. Of course, that's Is that yours? Somewhere. Maisie? Six. And then yeah, mine. I'm gonna wait Howdy, Andy. To notice. Oh, hello, little one. <laughs> little one? Right, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm, I, I, no, I'm, I'm a mother now. I can call everyone little one. Oh, well, are you ready to pull iron if you need to? Yeah, absolutely, with me imaginary iron that I don't have. <laughs> what, okay, I can, let's... what am I going to do? Spit <laughs> bullets at him? What do you mean? What happened to me? Because I've been in recovery. Uh, well, let's let's tell Isaac uh, Zip that he needs to provide you with guns. He just said he had a million of them. <laughs> he said I have something you want. Pretty Zip. much not long after he sent the one from Emerald. What are we uh, doing? Andy doesn't have any guns. Yeah, because Andy, Andy, we living a nice peaceful life, ranching. Uh, do you know what? Our getting, our starting to get really good at shoveling shit. It's just like changing nappies. He sent them maybe six, seven minutes in between of being at Emerald coming straight here. Alright, tell him you'll meet him at, uh... Where's somewhere that we could get, like, a good eye on the city? You'll name the place. He wants to have all the advantages. All right, well, you wait here for him. We're going to duck into the woods. All right, everyone mount up, duck into the woods, in case uh, he's not here yet. I have a spare set of weapons for you, Andy. They're just not a good quality. Do you I don't want know. them anyways? Sure, why not? From Wallace? Yeah. You're he's insane like, women, I know. He's, he's definitely out of here. Want, he's probably watching around now, probably. Where would be his next stop? Probably Riggs. 
Listen, I'm, we've got we've got all we need. Also, we've got so sixteen long. arrows and a dream. I had like the same color hair. Get his hat down. Get That's all we need to direction. run away. Other rigs. Or back to Emerald. Tree? What about a tree? He didn't have anyone with him in black or I think he's bluffing. He doesn't have Andy. What do you mean he doesn't have Andy? Who's Andy? You. Anyways, he's probably going to send the next one from Riggs or Blackwater. I say what we do is we go to the fucking cliffs outside Thieves Landing and wait for him. Alright. By Quaker's Cove. We'll give it mm -hmm. like 10, 15 minutes. If that don't happen, then I'll probably lay my head down. I uh, haven't had anything for a while. He's probably and going I to will go to back to shoveling shit. Maybe even Blackwater again. Right, we'll stop whoever we see from there to there. What do you mean, lay your head down? You owe me a date. Andy, it's late. I'll be around all day tomorrow to give you a date. We're also probably... That's nice, but I back. won't be! But I think numbers are full. I don't know yet. No, I can't hit no banks. Well, then that's perfect. Yeah. But I'll be around tomorrow. I mean, I'd love to come and do a bank with you, but I can't. It's not part of my recovery plan. Which is? Don't do anything that's going to have me head smashed against a wall in any way, shape or form or shot at whilst I'm in recovery. Oh, well. I am sorry that I'm putting you in the middle of a war. Oh, great. I can't wait. Like I said, just drop me off at Manteca Falls. I'll jump again. Cut out the middle man this time. Jesus Christ. I just saw him behind a lot. It's all right. He's keeping up. Yeah, here. We'll slow down a bit for him. If spaghetti grew on trees, right, would that make right. forks like mystical harvesting ones? Yes. Would it really? Right. I'm a genius. Hmm. I think all of these blows to me head's just on the reverse and it's just made me super intelligent. We'll go with that, yeah. Is that a rider? It is. We're gonna rob him so I can have his guns. Yes. Nice. How'd I? What's your name, fella? Does he have a name? Hello. Hello. Friend. Annie. Buddy. Buzz old hello. pal. Is Bella. that a local? Hello. I'm trying to have a conversation with you. Easy, 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 fellas, easy. Hello. Uh, oh, uh, hello? I can't. Is that a um, local? Somebody point his ears. <laughs> oh, hello, friend. Hang on. Should I just hop on the back of his horse and be like, friend? What are you doing? No, 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 no. We're having a conversation here. Is this a local? I don't know. Surely not. 
Bella. What is happening? Bella, what? Friend, please. I just, I, I, you know, I, I just want to leave. Okay. I'm gonna follow Cheddar then. Good talk, fella. Good talk. Fucking idiot. Here, clearly. <laughs> yeah, alright. Uh, He's lucky we weren't fucking Mora or the bastards. They were just shot for that. I think that was just a local. It might have been, you know. I'm no, so confused. No, it definitely wasn't a local. <laughs> it was not a local uh, fauna. I, 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 I want to go back there. I want to kill his fucking horse, Cheddar. <laughs> no, someone no, someone no, jump on his horse. Go on. Just push him no, off it and rob it. Leave him, Make leave him walk. Him. By the way, I really like this facial hair you got going on. Very dad-like. I um, had this. I can tell you with 100% certainty that was not a local. I'm just saying. I, 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 I don't know. I, I feel like no, I know no, the no, exact I, I know, same. No, 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 I know I, for a fact. I know. I, 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 I know you know for a fact, but I'm just saying that was very local person life. I was trying to push through my horse, and I was like, Bella, what the fuck is happening here? Yeah, I, I, this is God's You can go to Blackwater and say, I just almost got robbed by six folk. <sighs> Mass. They were gonna kill me. Whatever. Just whatever. Do this. No. Oh. Why the hell is there so much fire in this fucking plains? There's like eight fucking campfires. There's still, uh, fire up where uh, we were resting earlier, Shadow. Oh, like a ritual or something happened here, or what? We were resting when at the basin. Yeah, the fire was still there. I don't know, maybe the fires are just uh, burning extra bright tonight. Uh, we should cut our way through Calaga. <laughs> or not Calaga, what the fuck am I thinking? <laughs> I were about to say, I thought I was the navigation oh challenge Quakers! One. Quakers, we could just oh, uh, hide in these trees right here. Yeah, there's a spot what? where Alice and, and I, we all sit at the bush. You want to check telegrams, you said? Uh, yeah, it might be worth checking just in case he's okay, sending yeah. another one. All right. yeah, Maybe we'll uh. see that local there. So wait, what's happening? I'm, I'm still confused. Telegrams. Okay. For the love of God, and when we're there, give Andy a Lancaster of any kind. Zip. We'll rob no, no, someone. No, no. We'll get her guns. Andy, I don't know who any of these people are. The, I can do that really well. Push. Thank you very well. That's the it's weapon. It's Isaac, exactly. Zip, no Cheddar Bob. No right. We got somebody. Listen, we got somebody. I'm pretty we dangerous. Got somebody. Howdy. Howdy. You have a fucking voice yet, fella? I, I, I mean, I couldn't hear anything. I mean, there I you, you go. I well, uh, see, I didn't hear anything. I saw you were riding around me, but it didn't. I couldn't hear anything. I must have had dust in my ears or something. So I. We tried to point it out to you, fella. Leave him alone. That's Just... okay. I'm not that intelligent. Oh wait, me neither. Also, it's my birthday today. You should probably give me a present because you rudely ignored us by accident. Uh, I don't know if I really want to do that. I mean. What, what, what did you want? I don't What's know. Your name? All right. What's your name? Grant. Grant what? Grant something. Okay, Grant something. You're going to hand her your gun. First yeah, off. That's kind of what I figured what was going to happen. Right. She needs to borrow it. Uh-huh, yeah. I'm gonna assume this is a borrow without giving back, correct? Oh, no, if I Who ever knows? find you again, I do tend to give them back. Yeah, I don't really believe that, but fine, sure. No, you can I mean, ask yeah, every you, lawman. We could fucking use no, it on you I... if you want to keep yapping your fucking mouth, fella. No, I see, you could do that. I mean, what do I have to lose? Your life? I mean... Yeah, don't don't, uh, don't push them. They're really angry. I can always angry. give you a tissue so you have something. Oh. 
Hold on. Hold it's on. okay. I'm okay. I'm clumsy and follow me ass. What's your telegram, Grant? I don't plan on giving you my telegram. Okay. I'll just give you the gun. How do I get your gun back to you, though? I'm gonna fucking lose it as it. I'm gonna fucking lose it. Uh, he, uh, oh, do you need to take it off your belt don't first? Worry about it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me take it off the belt and I'll give it to you. I mean, uh, what, what can you say? What can you say? All right. Is there anything else you want? No, hey, go. Nice. Look, I you can have that. Huh? Right. Have a nice day. Uh, See you around, Grant. Bye, Grant something. I feel bad. He only had a shit gun on him. Fuck bad. him. <laughs> fucking bishop. <laughs> we should have killed him twice. Oh, that's what you're gonna do. Shut the fuck up. I die, guy. Yeah. There's a focus up, focus up. Fucking boo hoo, fella. Nope, it were a cattleman. <laughs> Are you I me? wish you said that. I wish no. you said that. No, take it anyway. I mean, he didn't care about his fucking life anyways. He asked what else he's got to lose after I said I was going to shoot him. The fellow was going to die for a $26 kettleman. I fucking better. have a Schofield I could have fucking given to a fuck. I'm gonna do it. Nah, do you know what? I'm gonna use this cattleman, and do you know what? I'm probably gonna do a lot of damage with it. More so to myself than anyone else, but. Finished, hey, yeah. listen. Uh, one of the best gunslingers in all of Armadillo just used cattlemans, okay? Who the fuck hey. was that? Gone. Wait, what? It's okay. No, what were his name? Dom? <laughs> Yes. No, I want to know who it where. His name is Clayton. All right, we have his location, oh. but it might be rigged with dynamite. Okay. Why not? You where the? What do you where mean? <laughs> <laughs> exactly what I just said, Cheddar. <laughs> yeah, like uh, what the fuck is going on, bro? Okay. That's so going. far out. If we go there and he's not there, I'm killing him twice for the fucking Wait, principal. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Uh, all the way west, fella. No, fuck no. Fuck far no. All, all the way. Fuck no. The what, sea? Benedict Point? No, it's farther than that. <laughs> further. It's the fucking Theoretical sea, man. Well, we were going, we go, we go. Mexico. We crossing countries? <laughs> Almost. I'll tell you what, it's about 10 seconds before we get to the greatest bank robber that ever lived. I... I'm so confused. But, uh, He's the greatest um, bank robber um... that ever lived. Don't fade out on us, Cheddar. Oh, I got my second win. Let's go. What telegram did you get, Zip? I got one from Danya. Yeah, Danya's back. Oh, Danya's back. I don't know who that are. Yes, you do. She... Danya. 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 Featherly. She rode with us. Did she? Isaac shot her. Isaac dated her. Your favorite Isaac's girlfriend. She was at No, Fawn's my favorite girlfriend. Fawn. Oh. <laughs> Fawn lasted like oh. Mave time. Oh, God. Like three days. Is no one told her yet? I'm so I confused. Uh, Andy, well, we... that's not very nice of you, is it now, little one? I assume I know nothing. Sorry, you did She's what to what now? No information to the cattleman. <laughs> right. Okay, so what happened to Dania then? I shot her. Right. So what happened to Fawn? We stabbed her through off a balcony. Okay, and who the fuck are Maeve? What? Oh, what, what about that Neve lady? Navs, Neves. Stabbed her. Nah, why are you stabbing everyone? <laughs> Isaac, this isn't how you find yourself a life partner. What? 
thought that's what you're supposed to do. No, you meant to talk him into jumping off a cliff. No, Ryan. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Don't ever, don't ever talk him into doing that. But no, seriously, this is not how you find yourself a life partner. If you keep killing him, you're gonna run out of options. Mills gave me some solid advice. He said if uh, I asked him how do I find my Alice, and he said to start looking in caves. <laughs> okay then. Well, uh, if I remember correctly, you quite enjoy yourself some time mining, so... You know what's funny is I found you in a cave, Andy. Oh, <laughs> wait, you That's did, didn't you? <laughs> I, think, I think Mills has a point. <laughs> That's how we met, yeah. She oh. was mining and we were looking oh. for gems. Holy fuck, you really did find me in a cave. Here you go, Mills strikes again. Mills is the love guru. Write that down. Uh, Mills no. is Cupid, he's muted. Yes. Yes. Mills is the Cupid. The Mupid. No, don't call that sounds like a disease. Just stick with Cupid. What the Mupid? Right, yeah. Who's got the Mupid? Yeah, exactly. It sounds like a disease. A very posse oozy disease. Ew. What do you mean ew? Alright, wait, wait, wait. Let's focus real quick. Isaac explain what the telegram said so everyone's on the same page. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> Best recollection. The end in New Austin is a cabin. Be careful approaching it. It's a regular dynamite. Oh, fireworks. Oh, boom booms. Which means if he has set a trap, he would have to get himself in a place where he'd have to shoot said dynamite. Although I kind of think it's a bluff. Well, we could do three. How about you go in from the east side? The rest of us will circle around the Coronado what Sea. What incentive, besides Domino being there, do we have to walk into this trap? First off, they might have profit. If profit okay. was in black water. Wait, sorry, they have profit. I don't know, but. Wait, no, what's happened to profit? I got a telegram from I... uh, Ned Fuller, Mexican, the Mexican letter. He told me that. He was still alive, and they took him to a PD. Like a deputy took him to a PD. Okay, but he's I got a, there. I got a telegram from Prophet today, a couple hours ago, in Blackwater. We went to. I told him to stay there, and that's when we went and found you. So oh. I I got a telegram from Prophet and Andy, both from Blackwater. Wait, oh, Prophet were really, in Black. What he really? What he really? Wait, no, Prophet weren't in Blackwater when I were in Blackwater, though. He didn't telegram me back. Well, he telegrammed me saying that he was in Blackwater. And then, not only that, but doesn't... Didn't Alice say that Domino robbed the wedding gun off her? Yes, he did. Yeah, but Domino doesn't have it right now. How do we know? Because I've been kidnapped and tortured by the bastards for days. It's Vern who has it. Okay. Is Vern wearing that shit? I don't know if he's wearing it, but he definitely has it. Okay, but let's uh, just let's just backtrack here again. What what's happened to Prophet? He may have got well, he got attacked by Domino, which is the only I don't know if Domino would take him twice. I think that's what Cheddar was about to talk about, but we cut him off. Sorry, Cheddar. I, I think I think he would. But okay. I don't think he would intend on her and Prophet again. But use Prophet to get to Isaac. Yeah, mm -hmm. but he, mm -hmm. the way he sent that telegram, he said, I got a present for you all. So he's been watching us. He knows I'm not coming along. What the fuck could he have? Well, he might not be watching us. He might have people like Vaughn staking out the telegram stations that he's telling us to go to so that they can tell him the numbers. That's really intricate. Like, that's that's a really smart move. Some political bullshit. I'd be worth asking anyone here if they saw Domino coming along. Hmm. I'm just gonna nip into bank. Right. If he doesn't have profit, I don't think he has anything. Yeah. He 
He has to have something. Mm. Oh, what night? Oh, I don't want to. Oh, oh, no, it's my wedding. Killed. I'm not going to take the med. Why? Yeah, he could have something. He could have six bastards. Why do I? Why do I have two rats in my bank? <laughs> Only one way to find out. I was wondering if there was something in it that I'd right. not worry about, like, losing when I inevitably get arrested in the next five minutes. <laughs> Never mind, I thought I might have had some blunts or something in my bank, but I don't. I just have a bunch of rats. I'm not even going to ask. Good, because I don't have an answer. Okay, if you are riding the six bastards, I'm giving this woman a gun. This... I've got a Anything. gun! You've got a gun. Listen, I'm just going to shout profanities from the back. Words of encouragement. I've had reach marble my with pocket. bastards. Reach into my pocket. Please reach into his pocket. No, no, no. See, I've had marble with bastards. I, I'm happy without having another one. Oh, very nice. In which case? Oh my god. Is that the horse <laughs> I think it is? <laughs> Whose horse is that? I think it's Grant. Let's get out, please. Let's leave. Please, little uh, yeah. I cannot talk to this fella again. There's another horse there, too. He was a secret bastard. But one! I think that could be his horse. What? You think that's Domino's horse? Maybe. He, he rides a black horse. Oh, if I Does swear to God. At least a doctor, yeah. We have a chance to get. I mean, we might as well. He doesn't know where we're coming from. Don't even look at the other guy. Yeah, honestly, I couldn't give a fuck about this guy. Not being sad. Don't you start kicking up a fuss now, horse. outside in black water we can search i mean there's two horses you didn't see anyone You know what this is time for? It's time for Epics and Philosophers with Andromeda Quill. You know, if you ate pasta and antipasto, would you still be hungry? Actually, would you? 
Because if it's antipasto, right, does that mean it's like anti-eating it? I never understood why they called it antipasto, you know. Actually, no. Maybe that is right. That kind of makes sense. Huh. Right. Why, like, what? I'm whistling for murder. Okay. Off, off, off. <gasps> Could you be a closet What did that fella say as I was leaving Isaac? I don't know. Well, he's going to get shot one of these days. If that was Lulu's horse. Vegan. I don't fucking know. I... It was a snake, Isaac. It was a snake. Do you know what I've never understood, uh, right? Why is a boxing ring a square? <laughs> like, why call it a ring when you're fighting in a square? Why not just call it a boxing square? Also, right, now think about it, okay. If a mirror reflects light, why doesn't it get brighter in a well-lit room? Like, why does the mirror not start shining more? Like, have you ever done that? Go on, next time it's like daylight, okay. Put a mirror in there, it don't change nothing. Epics and philosophers. You know, I've always wondered, right? Why do we say bottoms up when we're drinking, but we don't say tops down when we're eating? Mm. Because you put the bottom of the glass up when you, when you drink. Left. Ah, I see, little one. You are also a student of epics and philosophers. Yeah, I'm right. I was a quill. That don't make you yeah, nothing. <laughs> um, <damn. laughs> the cliff makes sense now. <laughs> Do you think like if his plan is for something before we get there, not exactly when we get there? Who knows? The bastards, they're clever. Trying along, but honestly, after this, if he is like running off and sending more telegrams, I'm just done for the night. Do you, uh, do you think Indy and Macy should stay maybe near Tumbleweed? I've been in Shouldn't. enough of the conflict, I don't think it's gonna worry. Shouldn't I think at the very least, just Andy... gonna grab him. Yeah, mm, maybe. Mm. I think Andy and Macy should maybe. I mean, I've been riding in this for two weeks now. Right now. What are they saying? I wasn't paying attention. Alright, well that... The cabin that he's talking about is right over that hill. Right? right What's I happening? I just need a quick second. I would rather... Seconds. Indy go with them, that way there's three and three. Yeah, I agree. So Macy, Indy, Andy, okay. Tumbleweed. Yes, why are we going Tumbleweed? 
Oh, if was there while we stand on business. Oh, I don't know what that means. I'm not sure how you can stand on business, but yeah, we can go tumbleweed. Can you tell my steed's not? Oh, yeah. No, I yeah. have got my trusty steed. Bartholomew Michael Xavier II. Let's go. And do you want to go with them? That way we're split off even even. Right, my love. Yeah, get yeah. off your fucking horse quick, though. Okay. Love you. I didn't know that what I'm gonna do. By the way, if you get blown to pieces, I hope you realize mm. I will be hunting this man down and he will have the most painful death man has ever imagined. Alright, for no reason at all, you grab my below left, the me, okay? left uh, ankle and frame it somewhere. Your below. It's a special ankle to me. Your below left one. Yeah, I'll give it to below the kids. Below the knee, yeah. The left yeah. ankle. Yeah, give it to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Make a necklace or something. I will do. Perfect. Love you. Love you too. Right. The house, the manor. To Tumbleweed. Fuck that shit. I'll be in my room. Oh, wait. I don't know if I've got a room there anymore. Watch the true trap. See that they predicted the split off. Yeah, Chad is right. Andy, uh, Andy and Macy should split off. Because this is a kettle like a kettle war. Andy is not Kettleman Gang. Macy is not Kettleman Gang. I wonder why they're so concerned with you. Is it changed from Bonus to Bartholomew? Did I forget to get his name right? Listen, she's a fucking cabbage. She doesn't know what his name is. Oh, we might have a gun in our bedroom. I think we should stand somewhere defendable. Why? Just in case. Case of what? Hello. Morning. I just want to see what's in my my room. Oh, what's this? Make it stop. <gasps> Nothing. Why don't my trusty shovel, my cookbook, and my homework, and some Victory Classic tobacco? Okay. I don't know why I'm getting this black screen. I don't like that. Oh, hello, sir. Ow, you fucker of a horse! Mind me, Ed. Mind me, Ed. Mind me, Ed. Don't do it. Andy. <laughs> what? Why are you being an asshole, horse? Is this because I gave you beats? Listen, they're good for yous. Miserable bastard. Andy, we're up on the balcony. Yeah, I can, I can see you. I, I look up. My head might Unlike be cracked, but my neck's fine. Oh! That's the bathroom, though. How the fuck do I get up here? I'm too small. I'm just gonna stay down at the bottom. No, you jump up where the box is. You see the box? What box? No. It's on top of where you go to the back. Oh, I see it. Yeah, you can jump up there from the staircase. There you go. Okay, well, apparently. Ooh, no, I hate life. Now just inch your way down. I'm going to purposefully splat and miss this. Okay. What? Andy! Okay, 
you're fine. You're not broken. But is me head bleeding? No, it's not. It's not. And no, my no, brain's no, falling no, out. No, no, it's, it's not your brain. My brain's falling <laughs> out. <laughs> I can feel them slipping through my fingers. I think I lost a tooth. Why did you jump so far? Are you supposed to just step off? Listen. Maisie, can you you can't contain the strength of yep. my thighs, okay? If they wanted to launch me off of a building, that's what they chose to do. You cannot suppress this kind of amazingness <laughs> and power. <laughs> I hear horses incoming. <laughs> it's fine. We die. We die together as close Andy. Nobody's dying. Just say hello, friends. Please move along. It's nice and polite. They won't say nothing. Do a silly voice and they won't even know it's you. Just be like, hello, friends. Please move <laughs> along. That's what my grand sounds like. Oh no, I can see the light. No, that would look, go, don't go to it. I can walk see away. the light and it's go saying that my husband needs to shave because he looks like an idiot with that beard. Uh, <laughs> I thought you said you liked it. No, I lie to him all the time. <laughs> I thought he looked like a mountain man, yeah? Listen, I stole like five diamonds from him ages ago and he still thinks that I do that's him. Oh fuck. He oh, still man. thinks that I don't know where they are. <laughs> Get up, Andy, in like a few Get seconds. The on the ground. <laughs> oh, he the jig is use this use the voice. Here it goes. Hang on. We're not getting up. <laughs> he shit on the desk. What are you doing? Breathe. She what? can't breathe. She's dying. She needs a kiss of love. Who said that? Wait, no, I'm dead. <gasps> Bruh, why do you do this to me? Just give me a kiss, you asshole. God forbid a lady just wants her husband to, like, kiss her. Like in those the fairy tales. Domino shit on the table and there was the explosive... <laughs> Sorry, That's are you telling me that time. Domino so took a took a leaf out, out of Isaac's like... book? I don't even mean. I don't know. I'm not known That's for that. Right. You are fucking known for that. Next time I see Domino, I'm gonna look at him dead in his eyes, and I'm just gonna, <laughs> gonna give him a slow <laughs> clap. I still don't understand clap. why people feel the need to shit on everything. I mean, well, you know nod. what, the fella, a the fella. Nod. The fella or should it be the a number table. two nod? The ziplets have better control of their bowel movements. It's because they're not Isaac's kids. That's very true. Wait, are you saying that Isaac is Domino's daddy? That's right. Oh, God. Isaac, you really need to stop sleeping with people if you're going to be producing absolute weapons like that. I mean... I'd be proud of him if I was my son. Right, that's because you like to shit on tables too. You disgusting child. Well, I'm glad everyone's sleep schedule is fucked. We ran across the crossing uh, looking for Domino and you found a pile of shit at the end. <laughs> Let's go to bed. And they just gunned him down on Blackwater. Why they just gunned him down on Blackwater? Like, yeah, they should have shot him there. Should have, you would have, you didn't. Next time you know, you will. In the words of Ever, I'm being too nice. I don't know who that is. I've taken my kindness for weakness. You also know whoever it was. Remember the day I shot my ma? That fella kept coming up saying, you shot my horse, you shot my horse, I need to talk to you, you shot my horse. I said, I have bigger things to worry about, I just shot my mother. 
I'm going to be honest, I don't remember much of that day because most people that say things like, oh, boo-hoo, you shot me horse, you shot me horse on repeat are non-consequential and I just don't remember them. Like, I, I, my brain actually yeah, makes an active choice to just wipe them from my memory. Murder. Murder. I'm going to shoot the horse. If you shoot murder, I'll fucking kill your father twice. Hey, he's dead. We no, he's he's not. Talk about that. Yeah, we need to actually have a serious talk about that. Profit better be okay. No, I think we need to put him down. No, we're not putting profit down. I told you, and I'm gonna be his joke. nurse. This is real, Isaac. If he keeps getting kidnapped, apparently, someone I forget who it was. No, we've already discussed this. I'm gonna be his babysitter. It's fine. Andy. What? Not right now. Someone said that his memory is getting even worse. Was it you, Macy? Yeah, I saw him today at Strawberry. He uh, didn't remember who I was, which was fine. But then when I said your name, he asked who you were, Isaac. What? He asked who Isaac was. Oh, I haven't Christ. seen him enough, I don't think. You sent me a telegram saying he was going out of town for like so long to go meet this person. Well, they're going to use him, and he's going to wake up every day not knowing why he's being attacked. And it honestly might be something that you need to think about, about telling him to face the meadows. Okay. What? Or slightly more serious suggestion, which I hate myself for saying it, but is it worth handing him back to his law friends? I feel like that's a fate even worse than shooting him in the head in the meadows. I don't know. He says, "What if he remembers Spawn one one day and walks into walks into Thieves Landing?" They will do anything to get hold of me. They are uh, very pissed off of what I did to ever. Right, I, they're going to torture saying. him, and he's not going to know what the fuck is happening or why he's being tortured. He's gonna he's gonna walk into Thieves okay. Landing looking for Spawn, right. and then they're gonna just shoot the shit out of him. Well, then I'll look after him. You can't be with him a hundred. Well, I will time, hang Andy. off him to me. The problem is, is he's going to wake up, and if he's not handcuffed, he's going to think that, I don't know, maybe go look for fucking Holly in Thieves Landing. Because he knew her when she was working there. And he goes into fucking Thieves Landing, and they fucking take him and torture him and fucking use him to get out right, of Right, okay, but we don't just go putting people down because they can't remember stuff because their brains aren't working proper, do we? It's not because of that. It's There's no place safe for him. Andy, we could send him on a boat to fucking England and he'll just get right back on that boat and not know why he's coming back. I don't know any townies that would look after him either 24 7 for this duration of the whole war. I'd have no solutions. That's that's rare. Can't we just get him a job on a bastards. ranch or something? The bastards are the ones who have been making this person in the first place. They went after Indy to begin with. Yeah, they did. Yeah, I mean, Coleco's probably a different situation altogether, but they did go after Indy just because Indy's associated with us. They're probably going to start robbing Danya too, but just because of like my old affiliation. Oh. They're probably going to fucking just go after anyone who's affiliated with us. Bastards so, always went after loved ones. That has always been their thing. Even back with Sam Bass. It has always been Sam's club and Bastards' thing to do is go after loved ones during war. I know. That and play mind games. You know that when they had older me for that long, they were, you know, basking in the, how much they love fucking with your head. Right, okay. But again, it don't mean we need to put the poor man down. There's no way they're going to stop. Ever since we came after Fawn, I think they're just going to double down. Okay, what about if I take him to Guama? Uh, okay, they will, they but will Andy, Guama. they will 100% come to Guama, but what happens if you're sleeping and he gets the itching to go to Thieves Landing and see Holly, Fawn, Ollie, Well, I make Abigail. sure he don't got no money. 
So you're going to rob the fella every day? Yeah, he's I am. Know why he's being robbed? It's fine. Well, I'll do it nicely. I mean, that could work, but I don't know. This is something that we're all going to have to actually sit down and talk. Me, you, Isaac, and Ollie. But I think everyone here, except for you, Andy, is tired and is going to bed. I don't know about you, Isaac. Did you just wake up or? No, I've been awake for a while. I had to rest after that shootout earlier. I imagine we... uh, Chad had already filled you in on that. Do we have a location yeah. on Profit right now? Do we know where he is? Last I heard um... was Blackwater. Elizabeth. Couple hours ago. We'll go looking for him tomorrow. I need to get filled in on everything. I think we're hitting the bank tomorrow. So I'll be around early, probably about five o'clock. Yeah. I mean there's a lot to talk about. Yeah, I know. I've been checking out as much as I can while you're in Cisco. I've been sending you telegrams, but I haven't been checking them. All right, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Good night, motherfuckers. Good night. See you two tomorrow. See ya. Yep. All right, Isaac. Andy, wrap me when you guys wake up. Andy, my hotel room's over here. Uh, so is mine. So uh. That was mine. <laughs> All really of our awkward. hotels are here. <laughs> right, well, I'm going to go back to shoveling shit then, I guess. You going to be up for a little bit? Mm-hmm. Okay, do not get fucking taken. I'll do my best. And try to sleep, because I'll be around all day tomorrow. Right, I, I might not be uh, around tomorrow. God damn it, Andy. What do you mean, god damn it, Andy? Be careful, Domino will, will fucking grab you at any chance. I'm sure he will, and then I'll probably find profit, and it'll be fine, and you can put both of us brain-dead fucking cabbages down together, can't you? Good evening, mate. Oh, fuck off, bitch. Uh, sorry. Andy, that's not what I meant. No, I know, but you may as well. Like, I literally, I, I was joking earlier, but I may as well just go throw myself off Mount Tackerful, shouldn't I? No, Because I'm only going to be a problem for you too. Andy? You've got an old man that can't remember anything, and you've got a wife that can't get a head hit. I know, but... You at least remember not to go into Thieves' Landing, right? I literally woke up in Thieves Landing and stood around waiting for people because I was going to say hello to everyone. Well, you didn't know anything until now. And you say I remember. I don't even remember who the fucking people that were just with us were. Isaac. No, I know that's Isaac and fucking Indy. Indy. Yeah, but the other ones. And you keep telling Cheddar? me names like Fawn and You know fucking... Cheddar. You know fucking Cheddar, Bob. I... Where do I know Cheddar from? The cheese guy. I don't know who the cheese guy are. And if I do, I've forgotten. Oh, you remember, so if oh, you're going to put down profit, you're going to have to put me down too? Oh my God, Andy. That's not what I... You're not waking up confused about where you are, who you're with, why you're doing things. You just don't know people because you don't know them. He, he legitimately thinks that he's like... What you have and what he has is different. He has a thing called dementia. Right, yeah, the dimensionals. He can't remember shapes. That, right, but it's a lot more serious than just forgetting someone's name or forgetting that you met them before. He thinks like, say you woke up tomorrow and you know that it's November. He wakes up tomorrow and he thinks that it's February. I mean, I wake up and that people that are dead. But you know that it's not fucking February. Not and you know who's alive and who's dead. You know that Jerry's dead. He wakes up and he doesn't know that Jerry's dead. And he goes out looking for Jerry. That's the difference. 
Jerry isn't dead. He definitely is dead. No, he definitely isn't. I changed his nappy this morning. Not our Jerry. Jerry Jerry. You mean my Jerry? Not your Jerry. It's 80 pint Jerry. Yeah, my Jerry. My best friend, Jerry. Right. My zombie best Wait. friend that your mother put on the back of a horse and slapped its ass and sent it off into West. That's right. Because she's a fucking idiot. Right. <gasps> Wait, maybe she can look after Prophet. You know what? Telegram her and ask her. That no. might actually be good. Really? I don't know if I want to telegram her because then she'll do that weird mummy thing that I don't like. Then kill her. I'm not killing your mother! Actually, I might kill your mother. You could kill her. It's fine. I, I don't mind. You know that she put me in a coma, right? I'm killing your mother. We're not giving her profit if she fucking put you in a coma. Wow, they, they, they're perfect. No, not Hell perfect, because that just comes back to the similar training of thoughts. That you're gonna kill your, your bloody uncle, which you're not gonna do. Tomato, tomato. No, I'm putting my foot down. That's not an option. Killing profit okay. is not an option. You find okay, another yeah. one. Okay, okay. And I love you, and I'll come back and see you tonight. Alright, love you. Also, I'm still killing Jenna because right. I think she thinks you're sleeping with her still. Kill whoever you want. Just let me know. Love you, Love you too. Okay, <laughs> I'm trying not to laugh at myself. Yes, please kill Jenna. No, Andy will forget. Like, this is the thing. Andy does forget. At least there's one cool that loves profit. Yeah. Andy loves her uncle daddy. <laughs> Fuck off, snake. This gun is fucking shit. And I keep missing! Okay, but you know what? Fuck that snake. Whoa there, buddy. Now, if we find this guy, we are gonna give him back his gun. That's if he talks. Oh yeah, that's if he talks. Now nah, we'll just throw it at his feet and be like, take your fucking piece of twenty-five dollar shit back. <laughs> I know it I know right, privy. This is this is what goes on Andy's head in like just full blast all the time. Watch us get drabbed now. Watch Domino grab us now that everyone's gone to sleep. I'm going to be like, right, fuck you and fuck the horse you rode in on. I just want to go back to shoveling shit. Don't even say that. <laughs> oh, sod's law. Do 
Night, Privy. Good to see Andy back around. Yeah, Andy's usually around. She dips in and out. She dips. She dips in and out. We we play Andy when it makes sense for there to be an Andy around. And at the moment, it doesn't make too much sense for her to be around. But also, I missed her, and I wanted to. I wanted to try some ranching. That's literally all this was. I wanted to try some ranching because I couldn't sleep. And I'm not letting Cecily fucking ranch ever. God damn you, bud. God damn you. I can love this guy. Hi, Doobie. Thanks for following, Tinkerbella. But hello, Raiders. Hello, hello. Mini! Hello! I'm so happy Mum is back. Uh, Mum Mum was just doing a fly. This was a flying pass-through. Ranches, you mean townies! Mum showed up to make everyone freak out a bit. <laughs> I didn't know. It. Okay, so obviously I know there's stuff happening in Cecily, but I didn't know anything was specifically happening like right now. So I got on, and Andy was just—I was just bimbling around, guys, for like an hour, um, like before I even started stream. Just like, hey, what is life? You were watching both streams, laughing your head off. Oh, just uh, Andy just lives in a little dream world, guys, and I love her for it. She's so simply, like, simplistically happy. Bimbling, such a great word. Yeah, Andy does, and Andy bimbles. She just bimbles through life. Like her biggest concern right now is not hitting her head again, because she does not have the brain cells to spare anymore. Oh, that sounds like wolves. We'll just keep riding, law. We ducked that up. She fell off a building. <laughs> Andy Gotti, guys. No, not Andy Gotti. She's not Gotti. She, she's Quill. Andy Quill. Hi Solo, I don't know if you're fellering me or if you're fellering Vinny because we all know that Vinny likes a good fella. But I'm good, thank you. I'm just glad I got a little bit of Andy Zip roleplay because I miss, I miss getting to roleplay with Zip. I'm curious, does Andy, of course she remembers, she remembers she's got a twin brother, he's a piece of shit. She's replaced him multiple times. She remembers his Axio. She even tried to telegram him once, but accidentally sent the telegram to someone else. <laughs> but to be fair, now would be a good time for Alexio to come back into Andy's life. That's an Andy thing to do. It's, I, it is such an Andy thing to do. Send it to the wrong person. Wish you could stay on, but you're hungry. That's fine. Honestly, at this time, I don't even know who would be around. 
Once upon a time, this used to be our seraphin hours. Maybe I should have gotten seraphin. No. Andy needed to come and remind her husband that she loves him. Night, Privy. <gasps> Thank you for the follow, Crazy Monkey. Hey, hey. Oh, horse, please. You don't like the idea that you could never make a seraphim emote more perfect than that one, a frog with, with blind glasses on. Yeah, true. We never need to make one because it already exists. believe that we missed oh no oh you're meant to go on the train tracks but it's fine <sighs> we'll just do this then i don't know i think you could win a lawsuit over it oh maybe hey look it's a boat we're not stealing it find Grant again. I want to, I actually really want to give him back his gun. Like Andy wants him to get his gun back because he clearly loved it so much. <laughs> this is when the bastards pick up Andy. I just know it. I'll laugh. I will fucking laugh. Andy won't even, she'll be like, right, just take me to Manteca. It's fine. Get us over and done with. She'll be like that. It won't be fun for them because she'll be like so compliant. Like I accept my fate. This is what happens. So for those that don't know Andy, although I think most people do know Andy, but for those that don't know Andy, when Zip was at war with the bastards once upon a time uh, last year, Andy leapt from Manteca Falls. And um, because of the bastards, they were they were going to throw her off of it anyway. So she essentially got a situation where she ends up going off of Manteca Falls. And it fucked her up. That's probably the one of the times where she got really, really fucked up. And the only other time she got really, really fucked up was fairly recently when she did the whole locked-in syndrome thing. Wombax is lurking, I just know it, yeah. Maybe we can just charm him with our, I don't know, our simplistic joy in the world. I highly doubt that. I 
I feel like going off piste right now is how I'm going to go face first into dirt again. So we're good. We're going to change back into our farmer's clothes. Why weren't you streaming that? What prompted such an early stream? I couldn't sleep. I couldn't sleep. And then I was like, oh, nothing will happen. I'll just stream. Uh, no, sorry, nothing will happen. I'll just like, just, you know, bimble around. And then I remembered that every time I say nothing's going to happen, I'll just bimble around, something happens. So I was like, fuck it. We'll just be upstream. We'll get a little early morning stream. And the reason why I can't be around as Andy for Bud tomorrow slash tonight is because I'm getting crazy eagle on for more than like the one hour session that I usually get with him. So we have Cecily tomorrow slash tonight, depending on who you are and what place in the world you are. It's not snowing, so we'll take that off. I've lost my horse. No, BMX, where are you? There you are. Oh, no. Red, yeah, Red, Red Lance is going to be around for a couple of hours tonight. Tomorrow, depending on, wait. It's Wednesday night? It's Wednesday night for me. would be a real shame here he is here he is you leave her alone she still doesn't know what's happening <laughs> she'll just be like fan take me now my life can't get any worse <laughs> this guy which by the way now we're not riding let's quickly so I want to do we'll grab there we go we'll do one for one backs and then give it like I think it's like two minutes and then we'll get one out for bird okay Wait, hang on. We don't need a gun on us. Actually, no, we do need a gun on us. Fuck that, because I will shoot these cows if one of them comes after me. Ugh. Okay. Back to shoveling shit. Okay, there it is. It's over there. Oh, no, no, no. That's one of the ones. You're one of the assholes that's going to chase me, aren't you? Stay away from me. No! 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 Fuck off! You leave me alone! And now, I shall shovel your shit in peace! Asshole! I hope you suffer, jerk. <laughs> Finally, eventually. I'm going to get this shoveling shit stuff out of the way without some asshole fucking animal trying to kill me. I 
just want to shovel the shit. Is that... Where do me... How, why does it keep going away? How many times do I have to do it? Oh, five times, that's why. Hi, Bitter! Hello, hello! Oh, Scarlet! Hello, Raiders! Jeebus. Jeebus! Hi, hi, Scarlet Rose. How was stream? And hello, hello, Raiders. We're just, we're just shoveling some shit. Is what we're doing. This is what we woke up to do, and it, we didn't get to do it for the whole one and a half hours we've been awake. I am never doing ranch work again. Stop it, Gramps. He's an emotional terrorist, isn't he? We're, shove We're shoveling shit and it's all Zoe's fault. Don't you worry, Zoe. I haven't forgotten. I have not forgotten you, Zoe Winters. <laughs> One day. One day when me dumb fuck husband ain't getting into wars because some wrinkly old man with kettlebells has decided to pick a fat, I will come after you. One day. <laughs> no, you can fuck off as well. No, no, no. No. Fucking, I hate, I hate goats. No, fuck up. Fuck you. No, stay down. That's what you get. That's what I thought. Stop trying to bot me. I fucking hate the wildlife. <laughs> and you zip about me for each other. I see this now. She's trying so hard to just do one civilian job. Just one civilian job. <laughs> right well i'm gonna go feed you now chickens and you can eat this like this thing here as well okay breakfast time breakfast time everybody hurry hurry breakfast time anyone that gets that reference without the northern accent it's bonus points. <laughs> oh no, did I accidentally kill a chicken? No, I think that was a goat I killed earlier. That's disgusting. Okay, catch you later. Okay, how much chicken feed is too much chicken feed? I, maybe I should just come back for this one later. I think I've upset your chickens, haven't I? Come here! Listen, if you don't eat the food, I'm going to eat you. Fucking go and eat something. No, don't. Not me. Fuck off. Your food's over there. Literally just over there. I just threw loads of it on floor. What do you want? A fucking plate? Oh, go on, shoo. Fucking eat the food. Stop chasing the rat. No! You're in the wrong direction. Ah, f fuck you. We'll go. We're going to go do something else. Take the fucking bag. I'm not feeding you. Starve. Oh, hello. You done with them chickens? 
What's wrong with those chickens? I said, you done with them chickens? I don't know. They don't want to eat nothing, so I'm thinking I might just fry them up and have fried chicken for dinner instead. Are they being stupid? Am I being stupid? No, the chicken's being stupid. I think so, yeah. Okay. Might have something to do with the sleeping goat. You mean that one right there? Yeah, right. Definitely not the rotting carcass one that's closer to their feed. Well, I was going to ask you how much chickens you had to feed, but if they're not feeding, I was going to go milk some cows. You got to milk cows? I got to milk cows, yeah. Okay, well, hmm. maybe I'll try the chickens, you try the cows. Oh, right. I mean, I've got to do loads of things, I think. Okay. I just don't want to be doing, you know, figure out. Well, there's like three cows in there. We could keep it. Cut, no, no, there's definitely more than one. We could keep okay, each other we company. Could try. All right. As we tug on the teats together. Fair enough. Oh, my name's Andy, by the way. Oh, Andy, nice to meet you. What's yours? Eli. Trying to remember if we've met. Have we met? Yeah, once or twice, I think. Okay, you're gonna have to joke my memory. I have really bad brain problems because I keep falling off of like really high places. Mm. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I just get shot near the head too much. So, this cow is the one that they designate from the oh. ranch for teat pulling. Well, you you do it, and I'll just talk to you. I'm really small. Okay. I didn't realize yep. how small I was. Why can't I look over the edge? Why are you so short? Eli, I'm a midget. Ooh. I'll keep her company. Hello, Bessie. So what do you do, Eli? Oh, well, I help out around here sometimes. Oh, uh, this is my first you know, time trying. You know, Misty? Mm, no. Oh, she works at that, uh, this, like, little bar that's here on the ranch. Okay. So I just come here and do odd jobs here and there, but I just came from McLean's. I was doing chores over there, and I came back and grabbed chores here. Oh. Or maybe we could go and do, like, a little, I don't know, like a ranch crawl, but, you know... Ranch crawl. Yeah, it's like a bar crawl, but we tug on teats and shovel shit. <laughs> okay. Well, it's your time okay. turn to tug on teats. I reckon I'm going to be really good at this one. I can kind of see over. Still kind of short. Oh, right. Yeah, no, I think I'll be really good at this one. I used to be a lesbian. Excuse me? Yeah, I used to be a lesbian, but then I married Zip Quill. Yep, yep. He's known to do that. Known to do what? Turn lesbians. No, he's not. I'm pretty sure he has a reputation of just shooting his mother, and that's about it. Fair enough. Okay, I don't think she liked me. I think I talked too hard. I knew Abigail. She's still alive? I hope not. Fair enough. She likes to snitch on people. I mean, all the quills have their things, right? Do they? Yeah. Okay, what's my thing? Well, oh no, you're married in. It don't count that way. I mean, biologically. Oh, okay. I suppose Isaac likes shitting on tables. You say chicken on tables? No, shitting on tables. Oh, shitting. I thought you said chicken. And then after that, I thought you said sh sh shaking? No, shitting, like taking a giant dump. Okay. I found out Isaac okay. has a son today. Does he? Yeah, his name's Rocco. No, Domino. Oops. Domino. Right, yeah. I was thinking of those name. French things. 
You yeah, know. well, he likes shitting on tables too, apparently. Hey, get moving. Like father, like sure. son. Damn it. You think he got it from his dad? Probably. Oh, wait, does that mean Prophet likes shitting on tables? I'll have to ask Prophet's him when I see him nice. again. I've met him a couple times. Prophet's the best. He's so lovely. He's me uncle, daddy. I don't even know what that means. Right, well, it, it means, right, he's technically my uncle-in-law, right, but my dad was shit in a snitch and got me whole family killed, so he's kind of like my dad as well. He were meant to walk me down the aisle when I got married, but then when I got married, I didn't even know I was getting married that day. I got out of Sissica and just woke up with, like, a telegram saying, come on, we're getting married. I had to rob someone $50 to go try and potentially get a dress. Oh, I was well, going to ask, like... Did you know you were getting married in the sense of like no. you wanted to? Or oh yeah, was it no, just you like, proposed and okay. I said yes. Hmm. Yeah, I was at your wedding. You were? Yeah, I was a plus one. <gasps> Wait, so you watched that silly old man pistol whip the other silly old man and then pistol whip his mate? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That made me laugh, lords. I'm sorry I don't remember you being at my wedding. Oh, it's okay. To be fair, I didn't know anyone at the wedding. It was real weird. Their gift was yeah, really was sweet, and I still have their gift in Andy's bank. It was a really sweet poem. I wrote you a poem, though, but you said I can't read. <gasps> Wait, that's from you! Oh, yeah. I still have that. It's in my bank. Oh, we're keeping it nice and safe. I can read now, though, kind of. I've hit my head so many times. It's done the opposite of making me dumb. It's made me super smart. I'm also a student of epics and philosophers these days. You say philosophers? Yeah, epics and philosophers. Okay. You know, like Plato. Hmm. You know, important questions like... Why are blueberries called blueberries when they're not actually blue? What colour are they? They're kind of like a dark navy. Sometimes green if they're not very ripe. Closer to purple. But isn't navy blue? It's not blue blue though, is it? You'd call them navy berries. Hmm. But yeah, or like other things like imagine if we could only ever communicate through interpretive dance and one of those little kazoo thing is. Mm. I think the world would be a better place if everyone just had to dance at each other. You ever ponder why people do certain things? Kinda, I suppose. Why? Oh, I just wonder why a lot of people do some things or say some things these days. Oh, right. I suppose everyone just says things though, don't they? I never used True. to say anything. I feel like a lot of people talk out their butt. Oh, I talk out my butt all the time. I don't think it's a bad thing. I think people just don't like silence. There ain't nothing wrong with silence. Well, you say that, but I was always very silent when I was younger. In fact, I was always very silent till I met Zip Quill. My brother did all the talking. It's because he's dead posh like and he thinks he's really fancy and things and he ain't. He's just an idiot that slept with Zipquil's mum. Huh. Zipquil's mum. Mm hmm. Right, yeah, so she slept with the twin brother. Okay, right. <coughs> hear this? Sorry, sorry. You're right. Did he be pat you on the back? Yeah, I don't. I didn't expect you to say that she slept with your twin. Right, yeah, I have a twin brother, his name's Alexio. Anyway, so she does that, and I disowned him, because I was like, you asshole, we ain't making this. Like, We're not from Alabama, we're from England. So I was like, can't be my you brother. You didn't no want more. her to be your, your, your sister mom? I did not want her to be my sister mommy. So, okay. so I found a new one called Connor. I think that was his name anyway. And I was like, you, you can be my brother now. And she only went and like romanced him as well. I know. The only one of my brothers she's never tried it on with is Barton. I think. And I don't think he counts as my brother anymore. Why not? Well, I haven't seen him or spoken to him in ages. 
And, you know, we don't really ride together no more either because there's like the quills ain't a thing no more. I mean, the family is, but, you know, the little gang isn't. A little gang? No, like their little gang. Like a, it's a little oh, gang. Oh, okay. What do you mean, little gang? No, oh, just a name I haven't heard in a while. Oh, well, I mean, it's just, you know, a size of a gang. Oh, you meant a tiny gang. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like a cute little thing. Quills were like this cute little gang. Mm hmm. How long have you been Rachel today? Mm, well, I tried to start like earlier on, and then apparently I was kidnapped, but I weren't kidnapped. And then I ended up in tumbleweed, and then I fell off a building, and that hurt a bit. And then I came back, so I don't know if I've been ranching all that long. Sounds it's... like an eventful day. Kinda. It's barely even started. I've been ranching about an hour. I came from Valentine and. Got changed and came here, grabbed first job, paid a decent bit of money at McLean's, and I went to St. Denis, and then I came back here. We must have just missed each other then. Well, maybe. No, like I said, we were chasing Isaac's son around crossing just to go find his shit on a table somewhere. Well, he's probably take better care of his kid. Oh, I tell you what, my freaking ziplets have better control of their bowel movements than half the adults in the crossing. Right, see, because you're ranching now, but you wrote me a poem for the wedding. Does that mean you do more writing and stuff? I I do have more stuff that I write, yeah. Do you write, like, more poetry? I have written a poetry book or two. Oh, do you think you could teach me? Like, Zip tried to teach me how to write, but I could probably do with writing gooder. Better is the word. Right, that's what I said. Okay. I mean, maybe we could set up lessons or something. Oh, that'd be fun. I could become a great author. Mm. Oh, I could write my epics and philosophers. Yeah, you're uh, pondering thoughts. Right, yeah. Epics and philosophers, like Plato. Aristotle. Bless you. Okay, I think I'm getting better at this. She's not complaining at me as much. Yeah, you're doing pretty good. It's okay, Bessie. I know how to treat a lady proper. Unlike my husband who's contemplating putting me down. Hmm? Oh, my husband, he seems to think that if you can't remember things, you need to be put out to pasture. It's because he's an idiot. Fair enough. Oh, ladies first. Oh, thank you. You know, I'm dead excited to have, like, lessons with you. I never really got to go yeah. to school. My gran needed me at home. So I kind of stayed and just did all the chores and stuff. <laughs> and his gran. What kind of chores did you do? What, for me, Grant? Or, like, mm -hmm. sweeping floors, cleaning windows, shoved me up the chimney a couple times too. You know, running errands, sort of things that you should be able to do for yourself, but when you're really old and frail, you can't do anything. Although, my nan always did say charity starts at home, so... Hmm. You ever think that you get stuck in the chimney? No, we didn't at first, but my grand thought I were a little boy, so... I think it when I got a bit older and got tits that she were like, hmm, you might get stuck now. Hmm. Yeah, it was a surprise to everyone. She thought I were Alexio. She makes you up all the time. Right, yeah. Well, she's blind as anything. And she's so stubborn. Like, she's still alive. I'm pretty sure she's like 100 million years old at this point. If 
back, she'll probably outlive me. What about you? Do you have any grandparents? Never knew them. Oh, I'm sorry. Grandparents are great. They give you like sweeties that are covered in like weird bits of fluff from their pockets. I mean, yeah, I heard about them, but you know, like I said, they were. I think by the time I was born, my granddad lived up in Newfoundland, and uh, he died by the time I, you know, grew enough that I could go see him anyway. So. Oh, I could be your grandmother if you like. <laughs> I don't. I don't think I need the grandmother. Why not? I'll give you like bits of candy from my pocket with bits of fluff on it. Mm. Uh, I've done my cows. I need to feed, still need to feed the chickens. I've literally still got a few chickens. How many cows did the foreman tell you to get? Oh, only three. I'm done. I could go feed right. some chickens. Okay. Well, I don't remember how many he told me one second. I'll check after I deliver this one. No, that's okay. I'm just happy keeping you company. Do you know what? This is much more fun when there's someone doing it with you. True. Well, this does mean I can't try and kill the animals when they try and attack me anymore, because you might tell someone. You gotta be careful, though. Only I would say your best bet is to only do chores here, because up at Pronghorn, you got the animals with, like, the wolves and the bears, and then I took a nap there the other day, and I woke up from my nap, and I was being shot at from both sides. Where were you being shot at? I guess some people were in a gunfight with Law, and I woke up in the middle of it. You know, I don't understand why we always end up in gunfights with Law. I quite like the lawman, except for Zoe Winters. She's a bitch that keeps trying to steal my husband away. Sorry, I yeah, love Zoe I'm so much. I'm not fond of her. No, why not? Did she try and yeah, steal your just... husband too? No, she's just shitty to my wife. Oh, you're married. Who's your wife? Uh, Jojo. No, I don't know who that are. Have you ever met Captain Henderson? Yeah, right. He grabbed me ass once in a prison cell. Yeah, his daughter. Oh, my condolences. Oh, I don't see him often, don't worry. <gasps> hydrate! Oh no, I can't hydrate. I don't have a drink. <gasps> hey, I'll get one and then I'll double what hydrate. This paper says. Let me... I've got to get eight yeah. cows. I have eight cows. Actually, it should be cows. I could leave you to feed your chickens if you want. Do you know what? Every time I try and feed those fucking chickens, they just stare at me like I'm mad. I'm going to wait for you to do it and see if they eat when you do it. Here, let go check. I'll check for you. Maybe you just have a problem feeding them. Maybe. How's your husband been? Hello, ma'am. Oh, he's all right. He's got a big silly beard at the moment. Get out. Oh, I hate him. I hate him so much. Not my husband, just the cows with the horns. Yeah. No, I actually love my husband. Despite popular belief. Come on. Yep. Oh, so that's what you do. No, chicken, get back in. No, get back in. Uh, never mind. And he needs to drink. Is he going to kill the goat? <laughs> you know, you can't feed the chickens if they're dead. Ugh. 
I'm actually generally waiting to see if he's gonna. Wait, are those assholes coming to eat where you... I just think they don't like me. Thank you for the follow, Leslie. Oh, wait, a chicken. I thought it died. Come back. No, go in. Go back in. No. Do you know what? No, come on. Listen, you clocky little bitch. You need to go in the other direction. <gasps> I think it got eaten by mud. Hey, don't you scare my chickens away. I'm not going to scare him away. I was trying to scare it back in. So you said your husband's got a big stupid beard right now? Yeah. He looks like skinny Santa Claus. Hey, don't you scare my chickens away. You I'm trying myself. not to. I didn't mean to. Hey! I'm closing the door! I'm closing the door! Don't shout at me! I'm just not very good with wildlife, it would seem. Oh, it's a rat! Where'd he go? What was that? I said, now I understand what you mean when you said you used to be a lesbian. Why? She's not very good at feeding these. I feel like that was a sexual innuendo and it's gone right over me head. You're going to have to explain that one to me. You'll learn about it in your writing lessons. Oh, really? Why? Because I write smut. Why? You say, why do I write smut? Yeah, why? Because people pay big bucks for it. Really? Yeah. What about, like, history? I like history. Historical smut? Yeah, no, not smut. Like, you know, when you read about ancient Egyptians and how they used to mummify people. That's kind of really, like, gruesome, but also really cool. Like, because they used to get, like, a, a poker thing in. and shove it up their nose and wiggle it around a bit and pull their and brains out. And their brains, yep. Right, yeah. But no, they're not the only ones. Like Vikings, the Vikings had some really gory torture methods. Mm -hmm. But those all really were fatal too. Like they'd put a little hole in your stomach and then grab your intestines and then tie it to, like, around a tree. And then they'd make you keep walking around the tree as your intestines just unraveled from inside you. Thank you for the follow, Vatrum. question mm -hmm. do you like like looking after people do i like looking after people yeah do you like looking after people depends on who it is i well, guess you like profit don't you i do yeah well maybe you could look after him so zip don't try and put him out to pasture oh zip trying to kill him no he don't really want to kill him he's just really worried about him because apparently people keep trying to grab him to, you know, get to, to Isaac and Zip. A lot of people want to grab him. 
Oh, because they're idiots and they're at war again because some silly old man with kettleballs said so. Fair enough. But like, Prophet in a war. Prophet is just like a sweet little old man that shouldn't be hurt or nothing, but apparently he's like been True. hurt. Uh, you try to feed the chickens now. I'm going to try to feed the chickens. But maybe, like, I could pay you to be like his babysitter. Hmm. Or maybe you could come to our reading lessons and writing lessons. Maybe. All right, now back away. Back away. I'm back in, I'm back Come in. Come to me. Come to me. Okay, I'm coming to you. Now just wait. You're like the chicken whisperer. See, they're they're eating now. I want to kill each and every one of those fucking chickens. I'm just right now. That's exactly what I want what to the, do. They're eating. What do you mean? I don't care. I'm so angry that they are eating now, but they didn't earlier. Mm. You fuckers. You feathery little shits. When you get fat and podgy, I am going to cook you up for... Oh, wait. It's Thanksgiving soon, isn't it? I'm meant to be going to the Grey's house yeah. for Thanksgiving dinner. Okay, so now you walk slowly towards them, giving them a run away a little bit. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Nice Scare them away. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay, see how they all went that direction? Now you're going to okay. throw it back down. Now you go, okay, now walk away. Okay, walking away, walking away. Oh, you missed, I think you missed your mark if they're not walking. Okay, so, you gotta get, no, okay, yeah. Okay, now, now walk away, okay, walk away. away. I'm walking away, I'm walking away, I'm walking away. <gasps> oh, he's eating again. I'm going to call them. There's only three of them in there. Bartholomew, Michael, and Xavier. <gasps> okay, and I'm just going to go over here. Now they're walking. Come on. Come back. Oh, come back. Wait, no, okay, other way. Okay, You're getting too close no, to him. No, back up. no, no. I'm listening. I'm really good at for learning instructions. My best friend Booker said so. See, now you got four of them. <gasps> well, maybe. I don't know if the rooster's actually going to eat. Oh, look. Oh, there you go. Oh, he's eating. Is he meant to be? Look Is at he you. Still in their Doing food? a good job. He's I probably still in their food, but you're fine. Walk around them. Yep, there you go. You always want to keep facing them, never turn your back towards them. Why not? It shows fear. Right, why would I be scared of chickens? I mean, they might jump up and scratch your eyes out, I don't know. I don't think they can jump that high, can they? They have wings. Right, but I have knives. I don't think your knives stop them from jumping. I do if they're inside their bellies. Saying that, have you ever seen a chicken eat a mouse? Absolutely chokes have it down. Have you ever seen a chicken eat a house? A mouse. Like a little oh, dormouse mouse. thingy, okay. yeah. It's horrifying. Alright, uh, now if they've stopped eating again, you know, push them away. Okay. Shoot. So basically, typically one throw of feed only, uh, Satisfies them a little bit. Sure, sure. Sir, fuck off. <laughs> Alright, now they're, they're walking towards you. Turn around. Come on. Oh, okay. look. The cocks go on there as well. Mm -hmm. Maybe. You might be going over here. Oh, no. We're just hanging out. But anyway. Would you be interested in looking after my uncle daddy? Looking after your uncle daddy and giving you reading lessons, maybe. Right, yeah. Or well, writing you've lessons, already agreed. Not you've already agreed to the writing lessons. True, I have, yeah. And you're going to teach me how to write smut. 
Right, back away, back away, back away, back away. No, nope, one ran off. That scared it. What do you mean I scared it? It scared itself. No, because you got too close. What do you mean I got too close? I'm meant to be feeding them. How can I feed them without getting close to them? No, bitch, go back. Eat the food. All right. They're walking away, seem disinterested. Throw some more. Right, walk away, walk away, walk away. Oh. <gasps> go on, go on, join them. Go and join them. Go on, I believe in you. I think that's by following me. Okay, and I think over here, maybe. Yeah, be careful of the branches. They'll hit you in the face when you walk away. Walk away, walk away, walk away. <laughs> oh, out, out, out. It's fine. It doesn't hurt as much as falling off a building. Now you said something about that. You okay? Oh, right, yeah. I just bounce these days. Also, I'm, I'm mostly numb in most places. I'm either made of metal or there's a part of my brain now that don't work proper. Sometimes my leg just goes dead and I fall over. That ain't good. Yeah, I know. And in the other leg, I've got metal in it. I've got metal in both sides of my brain now, too. I'm basically How'd that happen? Well, the first time was because I went over Manteca Falls because, like, some bastards. And when I say bastards, I don't mean they were bastards, although they are bastards for doing it. But, like, they were part of this gang called Bastards, and they were going to cut me up and throw me over it anyway. Uh, so Zip convinced me to jump instead. And I jumped, but I missed the water. And I nearly died. In fact, for a moment there, I thought I were dead. But that's how I ended up getting, like, metal in my arm and in my chest and in my head and in my leg. Mm. Right, yeah. And then, fairly recently, we were in a shootout with like the law and uh i hate to say it but i'm pretty sure i slipped and hit me head on the other side and now i have a metal plate on both sides i basically have like a metal helmet embedded into my head now mm. but ever since then though like, the chickens aren't eating no are more busy. oh are they not stop eating Back away, back away, back away. Oh, oh he scared him off. Try away. again, I'm try again. Away. What do you mean, try again? There's food over there. I oh, know, you're good. No, wait, no, back away. Let's see where they go. Let's see where they go. All right. So you said, you're talking about history, right? You said that the, the Vikings had the thing around the tree. Right, yeah. Hmm. So they also had, what was it called? The... The Blood Eagle. Oh, yeah. Zip really likes that one. He always goes on about it. I don't know why. I... Oh, chicken, please. I'm not a fan of it. Do you think it's something he'd like to see sometime? Like he'd like to see it. Or do himself. Yeah. I think he's already done it himself, if I'm being honest. Mm. Probably, though. Definitely be a sight to see. Right. Although, one of the ones I was dead, like, I found really fascinating, okay, is, I think it's Chinese, it might be Japanese, it's one of, like, the oriental -y ones. Anyway, they are, they basically lay you down on top of, like, bamboo seeds, and they just let the bamboo grow up and through you. Hmm. There's another one I heard about. It's just, uh, they lay you on, like, a, like a bed, and they tie you up. There's a little, sh like, a shoot of bamboo that sits above your head. And they pour water in it, and it just drops droplets on your forehead over and over and over again. Why is that? that that's not torture, though. Well, that's just yeah, giving someone I, a wet I, forehead. I would, I would say after probably like days and days of it, it probably become unnerving. I don't know. Back away! 
It feels more like it would be like a really, it'd just be like being in the rain for a couple of days. I think anybody in the rain for a couple of days would be miserable. No, I spent a lot of time in rain. I'm saying like continuous, always in the rain, hours on hours on hours on hours on end. I mean, on the plus side, though, you won't have to take a bath for days. <gasps> Finally! I fed them all. There you Your go. Turn. Oh, I'm done. Are we both done? Yeah, <gasps> I just gotta milk more cows. Oh, okay. Do you need help? Yep. I'd appreciate that. How many cows do you need to milk? Four more. Oh, that's not too bad. Oh, then we can go and see if there's like another one at somewhere or here, and then we can go and do like, like that 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 ranch crawl I was saying. Though we should probably grab something to drink whilst we do it. <gasps> Fuck off, you asshole! Uh. <laughs> Ow! I'm always really worried that they're just going to come straight for me and hit me head. Actually, I don't know why I'm so worried about me head, though. Because it's technically got, like, its own shield, isn't it? A built-in shield. Oh. With the metal? Yeah. I don't understand why doctors told me I had to be careful with it. Mm. I could probably get shot in the head and it would bounce off. Oh! <gasps> Now, I feel like I've suggested this before, but also I was told not to do it. I'm trying to remember when and who told me not to do that. I'll have to telegram zip and ask. Why are you standing yeah. in the puddle? <laughs> I was just thinking. What are you thinking about? My gran always said a penny for your thoughts. Uh, penny for my thoughts. Um, I'm frustrated that my copier hasn't gotten back to me about the copies of my books. Oh, you have a copier? Like a person who makes copies for me? Yeah. Right, yeah. Oh, I'm I sorry. pay him a good amount of money. How much do you But now I him? think I need to... Well, so the deal was to pay them... Because I, I tend to make a lot of money from my book sales. So right. the deal was for me to pay them three hundred up front, okay, and three hundred when they delivered the copies. Well, if you don't mind spelling mistakes, I could be a copier. You know, maybe I give you one copy and we see what happens. See how you do. It could be your writing homework for the classes. Right, yeah. Never had homework before. No, that's a lie. Zip gave me homework. What was the homework you had? Uh, he told me to keep a diary when we were in Sissica. Okay. That doesn't sound like homework. It sounds like a diary. Right, but it had, like, words and stuff in it that I had to use because I didn't know how to spell them and stuff. So I would write in huh. my diary how I thought it were meant to be done, and then he would sort of correct it and go through it with me and be like, no, that's spelt wrong. Oh. Well, that's nice of him. Yeah. That's when we fell in love. Mm -hmm. That was the first word I learned to spell correctly, too. Love. Is this before or after he slept with that lady? That was around about the same time, actually. You can fuck off! Fuck off, fuck off! Leave me alone! Protect me, Ed! Said that was around the same time? Right, yeah. And then, and... when he tried to, like, be like... Andromeda got it. Will you be me one and only? He started telling me some dumb fuck story about like King Arthur and, and, and Queen Guinevere and Lancelot. I, I, I weren't following it. It's a little ironic, but okay. Why is it ironic? Oh, you know. I'm sure you know the story. Of King Arthur? No, yeah, he, he pulled was, the sword out of his dawn, he, didn't he? I mean, yeah, that's the story of that. And then he I ran mean. away with, like, the love of his life, Lancelot. <laughs> yeah, that's how I read that. Well, that's what happened. That's why I'm Lancelot. Hmm. 
You think Lancelot slept with Guinevere because he was jealous that he couldn't sleep with Arthur? Oh, fuck off! Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> it's gone, it's gone. Fucking asshole. <laughs> oh, horse. Ugh. <gasps> Are you okay? Oh no, are you okay? I can't believe you've done this. <laughs> I didn't do nothing. That was the horse. I just watched it stampede you. Careful before they stampede you. No, I'm trying to save you. If I pick you up, will it break anything? Uh-oh. Okay. Come on, you big heavy man. Oh, okay. I don't know if I'm gonna get you very far. Why are you so heavy? Oh, okay. No, it's fine. We're just gonna go to a nice, safe corner. Here you go. Oh no, Mr. Eli. I'm gonna have to take you into town because I don't have anything like medical on me. That's fine. Okay, I'm really sorry, Mr. Eli. You could have just kept walking past the bull. You didn't have to shoot. You didn't have to cause this ordeal. I'm sorry. Just the horse kind of run me over and it made me really upset. Oh, fuck off. I will kill you see, too, asshole. See, I told you. Be careful. I beg to ask the question. Why do you and Zip like killing livestock? Rap, because they pick the farts first. I'm actually a very peaceful person if they leave me alone. Are you okay? I'll be okay, I think. Just had the wind knocked out of me. Okay. Hopefully they can blow some wind back into us then when we go to Valentine. Time with Andy, and we were also already lost. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> we accidentally killed him, Vinny. That's what happened. <laughs> we were so completely. <laughs> Still breathing, Mr. Eli. <laughs> nope, you took my breath away, literally. Oh, it's like the sweetest thing anyone said to me lately. Guys, I'm sorry. Oh, deep breaths. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, 
Oh no, are you okay? Don't die, please. Keep breathing. We're gonna go ask a doctor to blow you. Yeah, because that's what I need. Ah, well, it took your window away, so you need to borrow some. Oh, hello, are you a doctor? Hey, I'm not a doctor. Who oh. do you got here? Oh, it's Eli. He's going to teach me how to write stories of smut. He needs oh. someone to blow him, though. You know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a buyer of all literature. I'm very interested. Oh, you should buy some uh, of his the... literature. Author oh, of really? Undercover Passions. Oh, I'm very okay, interested. Just put you down nice and gentle, like. Uh, See if someone can, like, blow you. I would have Is to make okay? more copies for you, sir. I just sold my last one. <laughs> oh, he has okay. a copier, but the copier hasn't been doing his work. Oh, well, oh. Undercover Passions, I, I like copying myself. Because it's by request, mostly. Oh, it, sound, it sounds really good, yeah. My new novel, Moonlit Desires, has 50 pre-orders right now, so I needed to hire a copier. I didn't expect it to be that successful. Oh, we'll make it 51. <laughs> Appreciate it. What's your name? I'm Flash. Oh, yeah, Flash. Gun store, right? Yeah, well, yeah, and we, now we just opened a, a jewelry and pawn shop over in the small saloon. Oh, Good to know. what kind of pawn uh -huh. are you selling? Uh, uh, pawn. Yeah, the public. Uh, hopefully, we, we, soon we moonlit desires. Right. Yeah. Yeah, I'm starting a book club. I've been buying up all kinds of literature. Not... I just worked a deal with oh, a publishing sorry, company. I did not mean to get in, put you back down. It's really strong. <laughs> <laughs> You're bad. You know, I might need to go and spend some money very quickly. Uh, yeah, I should be able to. Let's see. <laughs> what happened there? This is oh, crazy. he got trampled by a horse. Oh, you know, a, a freak stampede. You, you know what happened oh, to me don't earlier? Lie. I shot one. You know what happened to me earlier? It's real embarrassing. I'm gonna talk real quiet here, okay? Okay. But, uh, you know, there's this girl, I think she's really pretty, and and, and she told me I'm handsome. Oh, and, I'm flattered, and but everything. I'm married. No, no. <laughs> so today, we were, it was the first time we had spent time alone. Uh, she went with me to deliver coal, and I crashed a wagon down a mountain, and she fell down the mountain and broke her leg. Oh, no, do you I'm know so what? I'm so embarrassed. No, don't be embarrassed, because my husband had me jump off Manteca Falls, and I nearly died, and I married him after that. So, you're well in. Well, she did say she had a good time and was looking forward to seeing me again. See, that's a good so thing. So it wasn't all bad. That's a good you know, sign. But I, just, yeah. I feel so bad I broke her leg. No. At least didn't break her spine. Wait, how's your spine? Is it's it still fine. spanning? It's, yeah, it's still spotted. So from now on, I think I'm going to hire a driver to, to to take the reins on the wagon. And, you know, I'll, I'll just ride in the back or something. You know, I'll be know mayor perfect, soon anybody, so. I know the perfect carriage driver for you. Oh, nice. His name is Barnaby. He's a big, rotund fella. Top hat. Sounds perfect. <laughs> Someone save Eli will put him out to pasture. Just spending time with Andy is torture enough. <laughs> all right. Let's put some bandages here. That's all I know. I really know how to do, but let me give you a hand up. Let's see if we can get you up. There we go. Thank you. All right. Let's go get you back to those cows. I, I don't know if I want to see those cows. Hey, uh, take down my telegram and let me oh, know when yes, those are. Yes, yes. What's your telegram? It's uh, you are upper room 471. Can't think of much for you are upper room. Ooh, yeah, ambiguous good, huh? rain call. 471. Yep. Flash. <gasps> Ultra wide rectum. Um, 
Well, okay. With your pre-order, it puts me at $12,750 in profit. Perfect. Wow. You're doing well. All right. Oh, oh bye, bye Mr. Flash. Again. Yeah, glad I met you. I like him. He's nice. Oh, come on, you. Stop it. Don't you dare. Up oh, you get. Oh, sorry. What are you saying sorry for? I was trying to grab a saddle for weird. I don't know. Where is he? Where did Mr. Flash go? Right to the store, I think. Oh. Mr. Flash, we're gonna go play with animals at ranch. Do you wanna come with us? He's vanished. He has. Never mind. He was gone in a flash. You know, maybe, we don't know it, but he could be saviour of the universe. Maybe. Just saying. And that is Epics and Philosophers. <gasps> oh, I thought that would profit then. No, it's Andy. Although some people think I'm God. At least when they say, you know, oh my God, every time I walk into a room. Zip say it sometimes. No, Zip's never called me God. Shame. Mostly he just goes, Andy! <laughs> right, just like that. I didn't mean to laugh like that, I'm sorry. Don't have to apologise for laughing. I laugh at the full time. You're allowed to laugh at your friends and your loved ones. I mean, do you really love them if you don't laugh at them? It's true. True. You ever been burdened? Have I ever been what now? Burden. Burden. Yeah, burden. Like bird hunting. Burden? Oh, I've ever been bird hunting. Really? Oh, I mean, unless you mean like Friday night at a saloon when you're looking for ladies. <laughs> oh, okay. This is back when you were lesbians. Right, yeah. Before you met Zip. Right, yeah. Honestly, I think it's just because no man had ever shown an interest in me until Zip. That's why you thought you were lesbians? Maybe. Just, you were like, oh, no man's interested in me, so must be, must be the ladies. Right, yeah. Well, Did that, ladies show interest also, in you? No, all sorts. So there's basically, sometimes, mostly. No, a lady called Mishka. She was going to be a princess of glamour and I was going to be a knight. No. Yeah, I was going to leave, like, zip for her at one point, but it turns out she's a massive fucking rat, so I'm glad I didn't. Hmm. What are you eating? Piece of jerky. Why? What flavour? Beef. Right, but is it like flavoured beef? Like they put some paprika on it, a bit of salt and pepper. No, it's just dried beef. Really? Yeah. See, left him there for all his friends to see, and then the rest of them are going to behave. Yeah, Zip's Andy. Andy! Damn rheumatism is flaring up again. What was that? Didn't say nothing. No, that man said something to me about something flaring up. Honestly, I don't want to know what's flaring up. That sounds, you know, medical. Oh, my good God. Huh. oh look, there you go. Someone calling me God again. Maybe I am God. I got told that some guy called Winslow were God, though. 
Some guy named Winslow? Yeah, right. He's an old man called Winslow. Apparently, Zip's giving him our babies. Like, you know, if we die. He's their god, Black Pappy. Oh, Godfather, yeah. Right, yeah. Except for the fact that apparently we're also Satanists. I don't know when that happened, but I remember him telling us that. So, is this Winslow fella Satan? Maybe. Probably. He was one of the people that threw me off Manteca Falls. So, give him your kids. Got it. Listen, they're like birds. They've got to learn how to fly eventually. Anyway, it weren't my idea. It was Zips. And I just kind of say yes and then do the complete opposite to what he says. Hmm. told you that you've got really big arms arms yeah like in a good way like really muscular uh, thanks i guess your um, wife must love you i bet you can just like one-handed piggybacker or something yeah pretty strong all right. Two more teat pullings. You can do it. I believe in you. <laughs> there are too many images in your brain now. I'm sorry. <laughs> How about Zip? Is he strong? Oh, yeah. Do you know what? He's somehow gotten stronger, too. Like, he used to be really shit at fighting. And now, he absolutely wallops me in one. Yeah, I remember him being shit at fighting. Yeah, no, he's somehow, I don't know, it's like he spent too much time in Sissica and it's rubbed off on him. Well, that's fair. You practice, you get better. But I think he's strong. That's good. Why are you long, asking me these as questions? Can... You know him. He invited you to our wedding. I do know him. You're right. <clears throat> Just haven't seen him in a while. Oh, I saw him earlier. He was shouting at me because yeah, he sent me a telegram, he except he didn't send me a telegram. Helping Isaac look for his son, Domino. Right, yeah. He left a giant shit on a table. Just like his daddy, Isaac. I don't suppose you ever heard about that, did you? As it took a shit on the desk at the Dicenzo Manor. And then I got that. I got shot down for the fucking privilege of it. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> you can't wait until Domino hears about this. Listen, if Domino ever grabs Andy, it's the first thing she's going to say. She'll be like, I'm your auntie. You can't do this. You got shot down because Isaac shit on a desk? Right, yeah. Oh, I'm that telling counts. you. Don't ever marry a Quill. If you've got the Quill last name, you're fucked. Well, well. For some reason, just having the name means that someone's going to try and gun you down at some point. I've given up being scared. It was too tiring. I'm just accepting my fate. One day, I'll die. And that is that. That's fair. Yeah. Yeah, one day it comes for us all, right? I suppose so. Though I'd very much like my day not to come too soon. Like, I do still have three children that I love very much, and I would like them to grow up with parents, unlike me, who had to grow up with the grandmother. Yeah, you never know. You could be crumpled in a stampede. I'm sorry. You didn't. You were fine. Look, you were bigger than that horse. It bounced off you. You could be. Gored by a bull. Fortunately, I were here to protect you from the bull. Who knows, that dog back there might gain the taste for human flesh and decide to mangle you. Which one? That one right there. Do not shoot that dog. Right, but you just said it was going to mangle us for human flesh. It, it was a what if, come on. One more teat pulling. Oh, 
Stop thinking about shooting that dog. I'm not thinking about it. I'm actually thinking about how Zip calls, like, you know, talks about bull milk and how you have to pour in the tea of a bull milk. I'm sure you know about that. What, Zip? Hey. Right, probably. He used to work for a milk company for a little bit. Yeah, that's what I meant. I remember that. Maybe we could do pronghorn together. That way, if someone starts trying to shoot over you, I'll be there with you. You'll be there to shoot and cause all the livestock to kill me? No. Do you know what? Despite popular belief, I'm actually not too bad at shooting people. Fair enough. Yeah, I once shot Rip Riley. That was great. So you said Prophet needs watched? Yeah, he needs a babysitter. He basically just needs someone to keep him safe whilst everyone keeps trying to grab him and hurt him. Apparently, Zip's not Zip, sorry. Apparently, Isaac's son had, like, hurt him Domino. or something. Yeah. So why did his son hurt his grandpa? Listen, you know the Quill family. You should know by now. They don't have any logic to why they hurt family members. I did watch Zip shoot his mom. Right, exactly. Time. I also have seen Zip shoot his mother. I feel like he's probably shot his mother more than he shot anyone else in the crossing. So Domino... Is Domino a quill? He must be if he's Isaac's son. True, he could have his mother's name. Or maybe. I don't know. I don't know the man. Never met him. I don't think. I don't remember if I've met him or not. So Domino is Isaac's son, and Isaac was looking for him because Isaac's son hurt Prophet, which is his granddaddy, but then Domino, Isaac's son, took a shit on a desk just like Isaac did. Right, yeah, exactly that. It's quite the story. Listen, it's not even the Could make a good dime happens. novel one day. Well, if you're going to teach me to write, I can write about it. Or oh, you could write it, because you're probably a better writer than me. I don't know. It needs to have your personal touch. Right. Some epics and philosophers. I hear you. Mm -hmm. Alright. Well, we should probably hunker down. But I might turn in for the night. Oh, okay. Yeah. It is getting pretty late. Thank you for the follow, Shrimps. Is it really? But the sun's up. Well, I mean, or early, whatever. You, you get what I'm saying. What are you looking at? See what else there is. See what they got. That McLean's job isn't too bad. $127. Do you know where that ranch is? No. It's out near Blue Water Marsh. I have no idea where they are either. In the swamp. Oh, right. I have a question for you before you go to sleep. Something for you to ponder. Okay. If spaghetti grows on trees, does that make forks like magical harvesting implements? Huh. I have to take that over. Mm. Also, well, would you rather have sausages for fingers or hamburgers for feet? You know, I don't know how to answer that question. Right, gotta think about it. That's what Epics and Philosophers is. Alright, well... Oh, miss... wait! Before you go to sleep, take my telegram. It's littlekiller656, because I need you to telegram me to tell me when to meet you for like the, the learning lessons. Okay. Okay, remember that. Littlekiller656. Littlekiller656. Mm -hmm. And when you see your husband again, send him uh, my best. It'll be dead chuffed to hear from you. Yeah. Are we just following each other? This feels a bit weird. Look, you know, I said I was going this way and you're just walking. Oh, okay. I'll go this way then. Okay, yeah. 
Right, uh, well, night night, Mr. Eli. I'll see you soon. Yeah, good night. Night. We are going to go into this shop. Astrid's workplace. God damn. What the? F Can we go out the back? Okay. Ooh. Do you know what? We will also. We will also go for I think an ending because I do need to sleep at some point today. So we will get ourselves out of here. Someone just fired an arrow at our head. Oh well, we've gone to sleep now. Oh, we do like Astrid on this character, we do. Cecily very much likes Astrid. Okay, who is knocking around still? <gasps> no, there is someone, there is someone, there is someone. Let's go say hello to... It totally wouldn't be Eli after we tried to kill him by accident. We'll go, hang on, we will go and raid Sam. Sorry, just Sam42, who I think they played like the hourglass killer at one point. I could be very wrong. And I will be back later on tonight for anyone in the UK. So it's tonight for the UK. Um, or... I don't know, it might be tomorrow in the States. Oh, I don't know. But we'll be on Cecily. So, yeah. Someone remind me to maybe tell Zip that we bumped into Eli. Thanks for the ranching adventure. Thanks for spending time with us. And I am right, Hourglass. Go give Just Sam 42 some love. And until then, miss you, love you, bye.